Hello, sports fans and football fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And you know that the NFL season is coming to an end, and we are in week 18. Now, last week I was a pretty good 11 and 5, and I could have been better if the Eagles had beaten the Cardinals as they uh, actually should have. Uh, but they did not. So um, I was 11 and five and I, I did pick the Ravens to be upset by I guess it would have been an upset by the Dolphins and that didn't work out for me. but uh, I'm, I'm not upset that that didn't work out. I am a little upset that the Eagles managed to lose to the Cardinals though in the Battle of the Birds. So um, yeah, but 11 and five, that's good. I'm 152 and 102 for the year, which is a 59.8 pick percentage. So effectively, I am 60 percent right now as we sit here. Um, but it would be nice just to get it, you know, that little bit over the hump to make it actually 60. But round it up, it's it's effectively 60. So, uh, we're going into week 18. Now, I want to have a couple of uh, announcements about my pick videos that I want to put out. Next year, when I do my picks, I will go back to the helmets. There has been a uh, popular uh, groundswell movement to get the helmets back. So, I will go back to doing the helmets next year for the NFL picks. Another announcement I have to make is for the playoffs. I will not be picking playoffs until we get to the championship weekend. And then I will have my usual panel, or at least various members of my usual panel, in to discuss who they think will win the NFC championship and the AFC championship, and then who they think will uh, go uh on to the Super Bowl, effectively, as those winners would, and then um, who would win the Super Bowl. So we will have that, but that is going to be the uh, week of the 21st of January. So sometime during that week, you can expect that video. But the two weeks leading up to that, no. I am not going to... Uh, I am not going to do the playoffs previous to that. Um, they don't tend to do well. People don't really uh, watch those videos when I do them. So I am going to fill that space with other videos and then we will do championship weekend. So with all of that having been gotten out of the way, let's go through these games right here. And we are going to get my usual, you know what, I'm going to get the highlighter here. We'll do the highlighter and to show you who we're going to pick. The first game is the Steelers at the Ravens. And in he, this game, I'm going with the Ravens. Um, even if they rest people, because they have locked up the number one seed in the AFC. But even if they rest people um, and they play like Tyler Hundley or whatever his name is at quarterback, I still think that they're a better team than the Steelers. So I'm going to take the Ravens at home the last weekend of the year, even though they don't have anything to play for, and the Steelers maybe kind of do. Next is the Texans at the Colts. Uh, C.J. Stroud is back, and he's bigger than life. I am going to take the Texans here, even though the Colts really need the game to win, uh, you know, to make the playoffs, but really so do the Texans. And... Um, and I think the Texans are potentially the better team. So we're going to go with the Texans there. Jags at Titans. I'm not even going to debate this one too much. It's I'm going to go with the Jaguars. Even if Lawrence doesn't come back and they have, uh, uh, they have Bethard back at quarterback again, uh, the Titans are just a mess. Uh, and even though they're at home, I think the Jaguars are going to beat them because they really want to beat them. Um, and it also, that's for the division title, too. If the Jaguars lose, they could potentially still make the playoffs, but then maybe not as the division winner. Next one you got is the Vikings and the Lions. I'm going to go with the Lions here. Uh, the Lions want to win the division, and um, 
They were kind of mad at how uh, last week ended, and rightfully so. Um, so, and the Vikings are they're they're a mess now uh, with that guy Mullins that they have at quarterback, and even if they go to Dobbs, I don't think that they could do much better. Next one you got is the Falcons and the Saints. I'm gonna go with the Saints here. We're gonna take the Saints, and uh, I just. Uh, the Falcons in recent weeks, they've just fallen completely off, and they're not very good. Next one is the Jets and the Patriots. I'm, t I'm going with the Patriots. The Patriots have been p playing inspired football lately, and, uh, well, the Jets really haven't. So we'll go with the Patriots there at home. Bucks and Panthers, we're going Buccaneers. The Buccaneers have something to play for, I think. I think. I'm not sure. Maybe the division title. Um, and maybe they could even lose out on the playoffs if they lost to the Panthers. I'm not sure about that. But um, I, they're much better than the Panthers. So let's just go there. Browns and the Bengals. The Bengals have actually fallen off a little bit. Uh, even with Browning. I thought Browning was pretty good. But in the past couple weeks, he hasn't been that great. However, Flacco is looks like the Flacco of old with the uh, back with the uh, Ravens so we are going to go with the Browns over the Bengals even though the Browns are on the road in this one Bears and the Packers I'm gonna give the uh, Bears the benefit of a doubt I mean they've been playing really good football lately and the Packers kind of really haven't and even though the Packers are at home I'm gonna take the Bears Next one you got is the Cowboys and the Commanders. We're going to go with the Cowboys here. I mean, they're just a much better team. Even if they, you know, put in, uh, I don't know, whoever their backup quarterback would be. And they don't necessarily want to do that because they could potentially win the division. So they have something to play for. Broncos and the Raiders, I'm taking the Raiders at home. Um they uh, they always play really tough football, and the Broncos now that they've uh, sat um, Wilson, I don't know. So I like the Raiders in that one at home. Eagles, even though the Eagles lost to the Cardinals, they still want the division title. They don't want Dallas to get it, so they have something to play for. And uh, I think, and they're a much better team than the Giants. They. Aren't I think the Eagles are going to have problems in the playoffs, but against the Giants, they're a better team. Next one you got the Cardinals at home against the Seahawks. I am going to go with the Cardinals. Uh, they're playing inspired football. They just beat the Eagles, and they're at home in this one, so I'm going to take the Cardinals to win that. 49ers Rams. Now the Rams are going to be a tough team. They're going to be a team nobody wants to face in the playoffs. But I am still going to take the 49ers in this game. And again, even if they were to play, not play Purdy, even if they've locked up whatever position they have, um, I would still take the 49ers. They're a better team. They've got better weapons. Um, and they are at home. The Chiefs and the Chargers, we're going to go with the Chiefs. I mean, the Chiefs really should win that game no matter what. Really no matter what. Uh, Herbert's not playing anymore. He's injured. So, and even though the Chiefs have not played, I mean, they won last week. But really in the last three, four weeks, they've been kind of flat. I'm still going to go with the Chiefs. And then finally, the Bills at the Dolphins. Even though the Dolphins just got rolled by the uh, the uh, Baltimore Ravens, I am going to go with the Dolphins because at home they are just a completely different team. And the Bills, even though the Bills really want this game to, um, this is for the division title, by the way. This is for the uh, AFC East. I think the Dolphins are going to win it. Um, I don't think the Bills. Um, can beat the Dolphins on their own home turf. So those are my picks. Uh, leave your uh, your picks in the uh, description or in the, not in the description in the uh, comments. Uh, who do you you know who are you differing with me on? Um, 
who do you think, uh, what picks do you really like of mine here? Again, we will recap. We'll take a look at every team that's highlighted is the one I'm picking. Hopefully we can get another 60%. I think we need like, we'd have to go like, I'd have to go 10 and 6 to solidify a solid 60%. Um, if we go 9 and 7, then it's going to be even questionable whether I would get the percentage point 60 and we will not, as I said, be doing the playoffs for the next two weeks. Um, we will be doing those um, for the championship games the fourth week, of, essentially the fourth week in January. And next year we'll have the helmets back. So that is going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.